I think we explore as a expression of our humanity. I design spacecraft and space flight systems for NASA. So before we ever land on Mars, we've landed on Mars over eight million times. Computer simulation, hand calculations, we use all of the data to predict the future. In this new era of services, it's getting to that truly preemptive capability. We've got to use technology like analytics, machine learning, and AI to get to a point where we can predict problems for our customers before they happen and then ultimately preempt them so they don't even know we're there. When we were developing the landing system for Curiosity, I would wake up and I would go down our risk list and I'd say, oh, oh, oh no, okay, that's, oh, that's okay. And I'd fall back to sleep. Well, you know, some people count sheep. I would count ways to die on the way to Mars. Our team's job was to imagine how it could fail and fix that. We actually had a customer where we predicted a major network outage 32 hours before it occurred and remediated it before it actually happened. How valuable is that to any customer? 3,000 people at the laboratory, thousands of other engineers across 37 states and seven nations came together to make Curiosity happen. We're going across 80 countries, multiple facilities in each of those countries. The only way you can drive a complex implementation of lots of technology and a transformation for our customers is have great process, great discipline, and great focus. The laws of physics are our playbook. Our experience at Mars before, what has worked in the past and what has failed, are our lessons. I mean, we've installed 50 million networks in our history. Having that level of experience combined with new ideas is a multiplier effect when it comes to creating technology and innovation. A culture of innovation is not something you can demand. It happens because you give people the freedom, the flexibility. There's no single person whose single idea is as good as that idea bounced off of a collaborative team, colored, twisted, modified, edited, supercharged. If you look at what generates great teams, it comes to the talent that you have and it comes to the culture that you have. The biggest problem that our customers have is there's a talent shortage. So how do we utilize our services to fill that void so that they can get the outcome that they need? What we're trying to achieve here is to get to a truly preemptive world where you don't have to worry about downtime anymore. Scientists prove the world that is. Engineers create the world that has never been.